I've done a bunch of videos on um, reloading, a little bit on casting, everything that YouTube will let me do. Um, but one thing, when you're casting lead for fish sinkers or projectiles or whatever, um, you got to be really careful to not put anything wet inside your lead or a projectile that is wet in the lead because it can explode. I've wanted to demonstrate that. Um, I made the mistake of that once, never done it again, uh, learned the hard way. Uh, but hopefully you can learn from me. I'm going to show you what that looks like um, when you put wet lead into a molten pot. Okay, so this is what we got. Um, we got a molten pot of lead here. Kind of see. This is just to make sure the rain or nothing would get into it. Um, we got a sacrificial GoPro over here, the good old Hero 4. Um, and then I got this pipe over here, and I'll be standing over here um, well out of the way so that when it goes uh, kablooey, I'm not going to be anywhere close. Um, I'm going to put a dry projectile first to show you that it's no, no problem when it's dry. Uh, and then I'll put a wet one and it's going to get exciting. Okay, so this is the lead pot, nice and uh, liquidy. Okay, so here goes the first projectile dry. Boom, no issues, nothing exciting at all, no big deal. There we go, getting one wet. Not very exciting. Normally it goes kablooey. Let's try that again. Wow. That's really anticlimactic. Well, what a bummer. Okay, since it didn't go bang the first time like I thought it would, I know it goes bang. Um, we're going to try some projectiles that I've cut into so they'll hold more water. Then we'll try this little lead stat tower that was made because it, it's going to hold a bunch of water. And that doesn't work. I'm just going to put a live round in there and I'll show you what it normally does. Okay, here we go. Projectile number one. Wow. I'm. Oh. Unfortunately, i got to get closer for this one. Screw it, guys. I'll show you what happens. Yeah, there we go. Oh! Okay, since we got lead left in there, might as well give it one more shot. Okay guys, so that's why you don't put wet lead in your lead pot, um, because this can happen. As I showed you, it doesn't always happen. You know, so there's lead everywhere, it's all over here. Luckily this is a normal shooting range, so there's already bullets everywhere, so it's like nobody's backyard. Um, but yeah, it gets exciting, so be careful with uh, wet lead and your lead pot. Okay guys, if you've ever had this happen to you, please put in the comments below or any other safety tips when casting projectiles or whatever. Um, and always, thanks for watching.